Hi, this is Ilma Art Studios photograph for today. Look at that beautiful turbine shot that I took, a black and white picture of a beautiful cloudscape behind it. Hi, check my website at ilmaarts.com for more artworks and photographs. Today I'd like to share Proverbs 13 verse 24. It says, those who spare the rod of discipline hate their children. Those who love their children care enough to discipline them. Here's my poem. Correction manifests love. Parents are given authority over their children. They need to lead them to the path to heaven. Mothers and fathers who don't love do not correct. They never guide their children, yet they criticize and reject. Parenting is an opportunity to raise children in righteousness. We will be answerable to God, who grants us mercy and holiness. Discipline your children in love and with all gentleness. They will learn the Lord's love through the, your ways of kindness. Here's my essay. When I was growing up, I was disciplined so much that I couldn't feel the love of those who are correcting me. When you discipline children out of anger or instilling fear in them, there is a big chance that they will rebel and go wayward. That is what happened to me. The Bible says in Colossians 3.21 that we must not aggravate our children or they will become discouraged. When you correct them in anger and not out of love, you, make, you may lead them to the path of lawlessness. Correct them as Jesus corrected those whom he loved. He never judged, but used God's truth to free them from sin. Prayer. Lord, give me wisdom to raise my children in your love. Reflection. How does society contribute in a world full of rebellious youth? I think because we... Um, have been um, advocating so much for um, children's rights and all that stuff and because we have had many incidences of child abuse our society has contributed for children to be more rebellious and um, since we live in a society of um, instant gratification we have learned we have, we have not been able to discipline or correct our children. We just give them whatever they want so that it will be comfortable for us, so that there will be no, um, no interruption in whatever we do. So the fact that we live in a world full of so much noise and full of so much um, commodity, um, consumerism, capitalism, and all kinds of things, um, we actually are advocating for our youth to be rebellious because if we don't discipline them at a very young age, we, you know, they will they will um, go the wrong way, and so we have to discipline them out of love, not discipline them out of fear or anger. Thanks for watching, and I hope you check my website at ilmaars.com for more artworks and photographs. God loves you so much. So do I.